Hey there, what's going on? Um, today is Saturday, September 29th, 2007, and I thought that I would do a video, I just didn't know what to talk about. So I went on to MySpace and somebody sent me one of those uh, ridiculously long, tedious little surveys. So the survey was sent to me by this girl who was working the front desk at a temp agency that I went into just a couple of weeks ago. The girl at the front desk had this funny look on her face and she's just looking at me and she was like, Chris? And I was like, uh-huh. Hi. She's like, we used to work together and I couldn't remember who she was. She's like, you don't remember me? We used to work together at Alphabets. Alphabets is this uh, little um, kitschy chain of uh, gift shops here in New York. And there used to be one on the Upper West Side and I worked there all through college. And I still couldn't remember her. I was like, what's your name? And she's like, it's Kara. And then I totally remembered her. We actually dated very briefly, like three dates. She was my manager for a very, like maybe two weeks at the most. And um, she had a little thing for me and I was at the time not, you know, sucking dick. So um, we went out on a few dates and made out a couple of times. And then I totally just broke it off. And I was just like, you know, you're my manager and I'm an actor and I'm about to leave and go on this tour and this, this can't work out. You know, I realize now it's, I broke up with her because, you know, other urges were on the rise. She had a boyfriend at the time anyway. It was really like silly. So it was a blast from the past to see her at this desk. And um, anyway, we became friends on MySpace. And if you're watching this, Kara, Hi, I'm sorry I didn't remember you, but um, what's up? <laughs> I'm a big gay now. Okay, number one. Have you ever been searched by the cops? No, I never have. Um, I did get a uh, fine once for um, skipping the turnstiles really late one night on the subway. I was at Columbus Circle and my roommate she swiped and I was like, hey, watch. And I like skipped the turnstiles and then an undercover cop, this woman came over to me and she like, she came to me and approached me and I stopped because I thought she knew, she wanted to like to know what time it was. I don't know what. And she pulled out her badge and I was like, oh. she gave me a ticket. That sucked. But no, never been searched. Number two, do you have any weird sleeping habits? Um, I sleep on my hands. I usually when I wake up, I'm like, asleep on my hands. I don't know why. Maybe I have uh, some Transylvanian in my blood or something like that, but um, yeah. Uh, number three, when was the last time you've been swimming in a lake? I don't know. I don't remember the last time I swam um, in a lake, much less. I mean, this is New York. It's. I don't know what the last time I was on grass. Number four, would you rather sleep with someone or alone? Mm. It's always nice to go to sleep with somebody, um, especially to wake up with somebody. So with someone, I guess. Uh, number five, what's hurting you right now? Mm. My checking account balance is really hurting me right now. Number six, who is your favorite boy band from the past? I wasn't that into the boy band craze, um, but I really liked um, Blink-182 and Eve-6. Sum 41, The All-American Rejects, um, Blink-182, to me, they were all the same thing. So um, I liked Blink-182 and Eve-6. Um, I forget which album it was called, but it was uh, the cover had some cartoon woman with blue hair. Uh, number seven, do you think OJ killed his wife? Yup. Number eight, Christina Aguilera or Britney Spears? I am all about Christina. Beautiful is still like an amazing song to me. If it's late at night and I'm on the subway and that song comes onto my iPod, I will start to cry. I just, you know, I love that song. Number nine, do you stay friends with your exes? Um, not generally. 
No. I think people too often are willing and eager to become friends with their exes right after they break up, you know, because it makes us feel sophisticated. If you can sit across from them at a table for lunch and you be single and yearning, maybe not for them, but just in general, and see that they're happy and with somebody else and be truly happy in your heart for them, then you're really ready to be friends. Number 10, do you know how to play poker? No. Um, number 11, have you ever been awake for 48 hours straight? Usually, you know what, usually when company is coming to my house, I stay up the entire night before cleaning like a crazy person. I don't know why I wait till the last minute. I should just clean all week up until they get there, but I always feel like it's not really clean unless I stayed up all night to do it, so. Uh, number 12, what's your favorite commercial? Um, hey, there was this old commercial from The Gap. It was part of their Everybody in Leather campaign. And it was a bunch of, you know, hot Gap kids. And they were all singing that old song, uh, I just can't get enough, I just can't get enough. I loved that video. I just, I wanted to be like those kids. They all stood there like so bored and dead-eyed and really cool hair and leather jackets and I was like, oh, I want to be one of you guys. I still want to be one of those guys. Number 13, what type of food do you eat the most? Breakfast food. I am a breakfast food freak. Uh, French toast, cereal, I can eat it all the time. I love it. Bacon. Bacon is a huge thing for me. If it's not prepared correctly, I, it pisses me off. Why would anybody not want bacon crunchy? Why would you want chewy bacon? That's disgusting. Number 14, when was the last time you had a lot of fun? Um, September 21st. It was Nick's birthday and I took him out to dinner and we met up with a bunch of friends at a bar down in the East Village. Some YouTubers were there and my friends and my friends who are still getting to know Nick and we just had a really, really good time. So that was the last time I had a lot of fun. Um, number 15, have you ever had a Choco taco. Mm, no, I don't know what that is. But I do love Chipotle. Number 16, the Boston Red Sox or the New York Yankees? Yankees. Number 17, what kind of underwear do you have on? Mm, wanna see? It's green. Number 18, how often do you remember your dreams? I usually remember my dreams and a lot of the time I seem to dream about um, people I don't know like uh, people I know are in the dream but they never look like themselves I'm always with a group of people strangers most of the time and we're all trying to break out of something like we're escaping a fort or we're in a car driving somewhere really fast trying to get away I always am dreaming about breaking out of something it's and I'm always with people I don't know it's weird, I don't know. If, if anyone knows about like metaphors and dream meanings, let me know what that means. Number 19, when was the last time you had a cappuccino? I, I don't like cappuccino. Number 20, what is your biggest fear? Don't worry about what my biggest fear is. Don't worry about that. Okay, last question. Number 21, have you ever sung in front of a mirror? No. Okay, that's it. Thank you for sitting through this whole boring little video. Um, if anybody wants to do a video response to these questions, I'm going to post them in the uh, column area right here. Right here? Right, right there. I will. Groovy! <laughs>